uh, I suppose even despite the defeat to make your T20 debut with the players you did, uh, how special was that for you? Yeah, obviously it was very cool to, to play here. It's a ground that I've watched um, England play on so many times. I've been a World Cup on here and I've, I've seen almost every single series I could when they're over So to make my debut on the ground is incredible. Uh, how, how was it to uh, to bat on? Do you think growing up here gives you like a bit of an insight into conditions and maybe how the pitch is going to play? Uh, I guess so. Not uh, not sort of knowingly. Um, I guess I, I could be a little bit more accustomed to the wickets um, from playing on them as a kid. Um, yeah, that's not something I've given a lot of thought to generally. And uh, just walking out to the wicket, uh, the position England were in, what was on your mind? Winning the game. Um, you know, it's very, very clear when you come into this group the mentality that you need to have. Um, winning the game was, was the only thing in my mind at the time. It's a, it's a bit of a unique experience for you, batting in the middle order, isn't it? Uh, I think you, you usually used to coming in up, up, the, up the top. How, how did you find, uh, I suppose, a new challenge? Yeah, it's something I've done bits and pieces of in franchise cricket. Um, normally, when I've got the gloves, um, so it was a bit different tonight not having the gloves played in the middle order but um, yeah it, it's a role it's a role I enjoy doing um, the game's always in front of you um, when you come in tonight and you're chasing um, you know exactly what you need to do I'll let someone else go thank you cheers uh, Phil can I just ask you um, when you knew you were playing did you know yesterday that you were going to be playing today uh, I knew this morning uh, around midday that I was in um I, th I think Bilbo didn't pull up the greatest uh, recovery wise after the, after the last couple of games, um, so that's when I knew I had the nod. And um, just in terms of uh, that that role, I mean, you say you're, it's, it's not a familiar one to you. I mean, your ability to hit the ball from from the first ball, if you like, is I mean, that's that's obviously something that can be used anywhere in the order. Is that you know, do you see that as a real positive thing? The ability to go from the off. Yeah, definitely. If if you know, it's a skill that not many guys have. So if if you can be good at that, um, I guess definitely it's a big weapon in your armoury. Um, you know, sometimes you get dotted up a bit more at the top of the order when you're open, uh, when the field's up. But you know, with everyone back um, and the scoreboard looking the way it was, it was very clear what I needed to do. So we've seen the crowds on the television, but can you just describe the atmosphere at the ground? Uh, the atmosphere. I, I know it's not. Um, Capacity, but it's always good um, in this part of the world, you know. Um, Bayesians love the cricket, love supporting the West Indies. Um, and, you know, the English are exactly the same. Um, so, you know, that, that's always going to make for um, a good atmosphere. Right. And regarding your innings, which of the West Indies bowlers you had most difficulty with? Um, probably Jason. Um, you know, ball coming from that high and you know, it's got nice changes of pace and variations into, into the wicket. And it's, when it's a slow wicket like that, like it was tonight, it can be very difficult. 